Sheep lets it, off they go, and they get away, and Magadan is the slowest one away from the stalls. Dare Me got a very good break, shows up in front, see the stars with this, the first of the pacemakers. Set sail going through on the outside, Vision de Tar, Grand Ducal coming through with those. Cavalry man is well forward with Stasolita, Hume Zane is against the rail. Set the uh, see the stars is not settling, he's got traffic problems there. Kinan, the horse giving him a hard time in the early part of the race. They settle down and set sail has gone on. Leads by three or four lengths, Grand Ducal in second. Stasolita, orange jacket in third. Dare Me and Cavalry Man are the next two from Beheshtim and Vision Detar and Fame and Glory from Conduit on the outside. La Boom is next from See the Stars ahead of Hume's Ain and Get Away with the bog breed towards the outside of Magadan, followed through by Tango Speed is towards the back of the field with Tullamore as they head on towards the halfway stage. Uh, begin the right-handed swing back towards the home straight. Steel Tango's at the back of the field, but these pace setters have gone on a very strong gallop. The others not really chasing them. Set sail clear. Grand Ducal in second place. Clear. About ten lengths ahead of Stasolita. And then Dari Me from Cavalry Man the Beige. And then comes Vision to Tower and Fame and Glory and Beheshtim. And then see the stars against the rails. He's still keen. He's followed through by Hume Zane towards the inside. Conduit's just ahead of this. And the Bogbury is next as they head down the false straight. Magadan behind those. But it is Set Stale who leads by two lengths to Grand Ducal in second place. Who's under pressure to maintain second position, although he is 15 lengths clear of the others, uh, which are headed by Stasolita, and then comes Daremi and Cavalry Man, Beheshtim and Fame and Glory, and behind that is Vision de Tar, and then comes See the Stars and Conduit and Get Away, and behind those is Bogbury as they head then down the straight. They've got less than three furlongs to go, and it's set stale in front to Grand Ducal in second place, Stasolita in third, Daremi four, Vision de Tar is next. See the Stars in traffic problems, but he's making significant progress now, Stasolita goes to home, Dare Me in second between them, come see the stars, Cavalry Man is next, Conduit is on the outside, they're inside the last furlong, he had a troubled run through, see the stars in front, Hume Zane's coming through to try and take second place, but he is the brightest star star, see the stars won it, Hume Zane is probably second for the third consecutive year, Cavalry Man and Conduit were just in behind him. So number 18, see the stars then, has done that unique treble, he's one of 2,000 guineas, a derby he had a troubled run through but he did win the arc by a couple of lengths Hume Zane it looks as if Kieran Fallon has got him through into second position for the third consecutive year Cavalry Man is there on the inside of Conduit in third and fourth and Dare Me has finished in fifth position Fame and Glory was next from La Boom and then Stasolita and Magadan so the winner is number 18 see the stars Nick Canan once again winning the arc, so does his uh, trainer John Ox, goes on to win it from Hume Zane, number one in second position, he sets his own record as three consecutive second places, he's the first horse to have managed that, and it will be a photograph by the looks of things for third place, uh, between Cavalry Man number 16, Andre Fabre's horse on the inside of Conduit, uh, Sir Michael Stout, uh, yet again close uh, but not having won that arc so 18 see the stars that's how he gets through there uh, some traffic problems in the early part of the race certainly for him he took a very strong hold eventually agreed to settle but an amazing turn of foot once he was asked to quicken through as the pace setters who'd gone some 20 lengths clear probably of their field at some stage uh, folded up